Okay, so this is my first attempt at an FCG, or a flying crank ghost. Uh, it's all home built, so here's the room I'm keeping it in. So here's what we got going on. Here's the setup. Basically, I'm showing it out the front window. Uh, this is the front of the house here. And uh, we got the black light positioned up here. I got the 48 inch black light, nice and secured to the wall. Uh, this is my ghost here. As you can see, I just took a uh, uh, foam head that I got here from uh, Walmart actually. Uh, painted the eyes so they'd glow under the black light. But uh, then it's just a uh, cheesecloth. Um, I soaked it overnight in Rit Whitener so it glows really, really nice. Um, still working on it. This is the first day that I've actually had it all set up and running. Um, basically, here's the homemade rig that I made. Now, this was a motor that I found off a link from a guy from the Halloween Forum. And so far the motor's working out all right. Um, that motor was supposed to work a ventilation system in a, a car, right? But it's been spot spliced and uh, tied in so it runs off AC. So here's my, uh, my little uh, controller block right here. Basically, I just have to have the uh, black light plugged in along with the plug for the FCG. Runs straight up there. All right, so uh, here's the uh, here's the motion. Let's go ahead and turn it on. Right. So it's not bad. It's uh, I need to work on the cheesecloth a little bit, make it, make it flow a little bit better. Uh, motion's not too bad, it's not too herky-jerky, it's nice and slow enough. Um, so here's my mechanism, here's how everything works. There you can kind of see how the, all the strings are positioned onto the, the washer there. All in all, pretty well, pretty well. I'm pretty happy with it. Um, tonight I'll get the uh, night shot so we can really see what it's gonna look like. I uh, went out and did a test run earlier outside and that motion in the up and down is actually really, really perfect for the perspective that the people are gonna see it at. So, uh, fingers crossed and uh, thanks for watching my video.